You ever feel overwhelmed by information? Like you're trying to cram too much into your brain and it just slips out. Here's a secret used by memory champions and creative thinkers alike, even geniuses like Leonardo da Vinci. It's called a mind map, and it might be one of the most powerful tools you're currently not using. A mind map is a visual way to organize your information. Instead of writing in straight lines like an essay, you start with the central idea in the middle of the page, and from there you branch out with curved lines, each one representing a related thought or, or, or an idea or a key word. The result? You're literally mimicking the way your brain naturally works through these associations, through connections, through imagery. Here's why mind maps are pure gold. When you think about the areas of the brain and what they are involved in, there are some that are preferential to specific processes or emotional salience or the delivery of logic. With a mind map, it encourages multiple areas from all sides of the creative journey to get involved. This isn't about hemispheric preference. This, the science is iffy in that area at best. But this is about multi lobes getting involved in how you memorize anything. Mind maps are a way to bring them all online. They create hooks for your memory. So instead of trying to memorize isolated data, mind maps give your brain mental um, anchors. When you recall one part of the map, it triggers the rest, like the link system or the journey, right? It is a reduction in cognitive load by showing relationships and patterns visually. So you start in the center with your main topic or your main theme, whichever it is. Then you use branches for key points or, or categories and sub branches with keywords or images or symbols. You can have them coded in colors. You can have them coded in imagery. It is a way to differentiate topics and trigger emotional salience in the memory consolidation. You keep it flowing and curved your brain likes natural, non-linear shapes. But above all, don't overthink it. Mind maps are about clarity and creativity, not perfection. So try it today. Take one thing you're learning, or one thing you're trying to learn or remember, and turn it into a mind map. You'll be amazed how your recall sharpens and your thinking clears up. Because when you think like your brain thinks, you remember like your brain remembers.